Hi, this is Mary Flower, and I'm going to sell another Flow East Journey journal. Excuse me. And I put them in these priority mail bags. And this one has to do with um, Retro Kitchen. And so I want to show you what is going to be included in this bag. I'll start with an envelope of papers and images. And you can see what I have. It's just loaded with images that have to do with the kitchen. A lot of old advertisements. And most of these are right out of either a book or old magazines. And I will put them right here. I have a couple of these little punch-out papers here which formulate actually a little window so i'm going to put that so in case you would like to do something with a kitchen window i have a couple of these beautiful envelopes with a big card and it can write on the back very beautiful very beautiful images of people working in the kitchen and you'll see advertisements about the kitchen some nice smaller um, pieces of designer paper that all look like wallpaper old milk carton tabs i remember these when i was little you used you used to be able to save them and go buy something with them and we just liked them Um, this is from a retro kitchen book. I love the illustrations and the plain colors. So I've just loaded up all the images. This is from an old cookbook. It even looks sort of, you know, yellowed. I really like the way it looks. Looks like cookies. And some actual pages from a very old magazine, maybe from the 50s, 60s. I'm not sure, but they all have to do with the kitchen. You can use either side, however you'd like to do that. This one is about an oven. Old Betty Crocker. So I've loaded up with a lot of old advertisements. Top Tam. And then I give have given you over. Uh, well, first of all, these four top pages they look just like colored pages, but they're not. They're actually, if you look really close, if I can show you, they're punch out letters. So each these four here. I have several alphabets on each one, and I don't know if you can see it, but it will be included. I'm being careful with it because they're easy to punch out. Some different size doilies. And then um, a, a bunch of different kinds of papers. Uh, beautiful linen type papers. Um, some graph papers. There's a bunch of these, if you can just look. Then uh, some more linen type papers. These are beautiful papers, almost see-through. Very heavy and beautiful. Well, they, they give well, but they have a, a strength to them. It's really beautiful. And then some very nice lined paper. This is kind of a thicker type of paper, not just your cheap paper. 
and these are all different kinds of beautiful papers to go with this as well. So that's included just in the uh, large envelope. Let me see if I can put this stuff back here. So that one will go in this envelope. Then I will have this, which I have put a nice piece of cloth that goes with retro cooking. I mean the retro kitchen. And you can use it however you'd like. And it goes with this. Now there is a local restaurant not too far from me that gives out these beautiful boxes if you can see them with nice images on them and it, it's really beautiful and i've made part of the flowish journal in here i've just put them inside i'm gonna pull these out to show you what we have here I've also included this nice piece of colored uh, jelly print paper, watercolor paper, which is really nice and thick for whatever you'd like to use. And I will show you the papers. Very nice kitchen type uh, designer paper. These are a little bit thick. Some, those are tissue papers more of the uh, designer papers then papers these are from a really nice book they have old chairs in them tables if you can see retro style tables china hutches window treatments more china hutches uh, kitchen clocks, some um, nice more paper that's small, and some very beautiful designer paper here that goes with all of this. These have little teapots on them, you can see. Uh, some more tables from that book. They're wonderful things. I took everything that had to do with the kitchen out of it. more papers there's about four of these and they all look retro kitchen it has a a bowl with a chair i hope you can see all this i hope i'm not going too fast more paper that is tissue paper that looks retro kitchen things that look like um wallpaper smaller designer paper with smaller uh, little images on it which is really pretty and I hope you can see this I hope that lights on it good enough here so then this will be uh, put in that with these here and then I have two more things that go in here. And I'll show you in a minute. It's another small envelope of really yummy things. A cute little card with cupcakes. Different kinds of cards, retro looking cards. Some really old recipes. This one is printed, actually typed on an old typewriter. A few little stickers, some nice tabs, some guest, it looks like I have it upside down, some guest checks, several of those, um, some teacups, tags, more tags, clever little um, recipe cards with a fork and spoon on them, and some more recipe cards. This is Mom's Diner. More old recipes and then very small uh, printed um, designer paper here. 
show you I'm including a lot of a lot of really nice papers for this and different kinds of things you can use on this and that will be in the second small one and then uh, all of these kind of three-dimensional type things are will be used for your retro kitchen and let me go through some of these a little bit of retro wallpaper i've just curled it up a little bit of cloth it looks like a little hot pad i hope i'm not going too fast here several small ribbon that have kind of a retro look i have cards that look like pieces of cake i have some wonderful little uh, chipboard things that have to do with the kitchen i have different kinds of teacups teapots you know those kind of things strawberries beets Let's see if I have some other ones here. A little ice cream and some little berries that goes in there. I have different kinds of buttons that look like little ice cream. I have a little banana. So can you see those? Then I have... cloth, a cherry, and the large strawberries, an old, wonderful tin measuring spoon. Oh, it's beautiful. And I have another little sugar bowl there. These are really cute. These are little Oreo cookies that have been crocheted, and they're just really, really cute. I have a couple of nice paper clips to go on here. A couple of brads. One is a mixing machine and a little cupcake. And I have some metal um, silverware that goes in there. A wonderful little felt yummy looking cookie that I almost want to eat it because it's done so cute. And then a piece of large rickrack. Rick and so it, you will be getting this one, and this one, and this one, and this one. So um, if you like what you if you like what you see, give me a thumbs up, a comment, and as soon as I get this on YouTube. I will also put it on eBay and I will try to link those two things together so that you will see. So if you like it, go over to my eBay and check it out. Thanks.